What's up guys, Zav here, and today I am back with our episode 1 of a new series that I thought of doing. It's not anything really unique, it's sort of a test series and a money making series. Uh, as you can see, we do have 8,000 coins in the top right hand corner. Um, this isn't my main account, uh, and it's basically going to be a series on bronze pack method and does it really still work in FIFA 13 so oh yes we got the 8,000 coins and I will show you just now in my club that we do not have any players uh, any staff uh, we obviously got club items because you can't really get rid of them and a few consumables but we won't really use them so yeah so what we would do is we will open the 400 coin bronze packs and obviously sell the quantities inside and see if we can make a profit so let's get started into our first one guys okay so we start with 8,000 coins let's get into it okay so first pack let's have a look who we can get we won't get anything amazing as you can see here, just a few decent players, and we do get uh, coins, bonus, which is good. So obviously we redeem the coins, collect the free coins, and we will go back here and we will quick auction these, 200. Anything else here that might sell, probably not. So when we go back out, nothing else really here that might sell. That might sell, people might like that kit. You never know, do you? And let's quick sell that one then, guys. Anyway, go back, going back to the store. Uh, let's open our next pack. Just skip this now. Ah, we do get a rare player, Griffin, but we'll only probably sell for about 200 coins. And, um, yeah, not looking too great here so far. Contracts, uh, Probably won't sell. That was not a great pack, guys. But obviously, so far it doesn't look too clever. We don't seem like we have uh, too much. So we will obviously keep opening the packs um, until our trade pad is full, because obviously the video won't go any longer. And we will then, so obviously, I'll end the recording. I'll put the players up. I'll end the recording. Oh, plus two hundred. Thank you very much. And then I will come back and I will show you what has sold at the end of the uh, uh, time. And they will be put up for only only one hour, guys. But if some don't sell, I'll probably give them another try after this. But if they do not sell, then I will show you that. So, really, it's basically a two-hour thing showing you how much you could expect to really make or, or so far what it looks like probably lose money. And obviously in this pack we do get a Scottish striker but it doesn't look too great but we will have a go at selling him. Uh, any English players you really want to try and sell uh, because English are probably the most popular bronze types of players that you can get. And it's been a bit unusual, I don't think we've had a fitness, any fitness cards yet. So yeah. Just gonna keep opening these, you know. See what we're getting at. See this guy, Obadei. Now he could really sell. He could probably sell for around that. I'm just gonna put him up for that. These are just estimations of what I would think. So I swear we've already had him up for. And so we did get a few English players in this pack. So that was that was quite decent. And this guy's in a good formation, and he's got. Face, so start that up. Oh, that, well, that wasn't a bad pack, and probably some people might want to buy their Northampton kit because of Ashley and Denmark. All well, that good stuff. So, yeah, we'll go back to the store and we'll open a few more. I didn't see how many spaces we still had left in our trade pile, probably about half full by now. And we do get another English player with high reflexes there. We're happy with that. <laughs> so it's actually proving to be 
pretty okay this bronze pack method so far. Uh, would that sell? Oh, I doubt it. I'm just going to sell anyways. And there we go. We're really just going to keep doing this. Um, come on then. Come on. So, oh, that was a bit. That was a bit bad. Um, German might sell. Yeah, Germans might sell because Germans, I'd probably say, are one of the second popular um, fitnesses. Now, these are quite good to get because if you get more than one fitness in a pack, you know you've pretty much made a profit because they do sell pretty quickly for 250 coins. And as you can see here, that's that's probably around it. It's, it's probably around what you'll get there. And so these TVs just got just got under 6,000 coins at the moment. Can't see the exact at the moment and we do get another English player in a good formation with decent pace uh, I will be putting him up for no not that much this is just my estimations guys and as it is early on in the uh, FIFA 13 community people will be looking to buy their players and the prices are always a bit more expensive at the start of the uh, campaign should I say so I'm uh, moving on to the uh, Probably close to the end of our pack opening moment. Uh, do get a Belgian manager. I'm not sure. He he plays in the uh, one of the English leagues, so he might sell. And so will that keeper right here, Bennett. Should should sell. Should sell. Another Northampton kit, guys. So hopefully that will sell. How many places? Not that many places left in our trade pile anymore. Managers, nah, I, I can't bother with them if you ask me to be honest with that. There we go. And we will open a few more packs. Um, now, this guy will probably sell because he plays for Burnley. I think it was it Burn. I think it was Burnley, alright. And that was pretty bad. Um, I might do one more now, lads, okay? One more. This video is getting quite long. I don't want it to be too long and boring. But it's probably worth it. That guy's pretty pacey. And but will probably only sell for around that because he's not in a very popular league or anything. Sheffield, we'll give it a go. See if we can make the most profit that we can. That ball's quite nice, so that's uh, alright. And we'll probably open one pack after this. So this is our last pack, guys, and then we will... Ah, very nice. Thank you very much. Jacobs. Another one there, try in. And that looks about it, lads. Okay, so our ending price is around 4,000... 989 and our start price was around 8,000 uh, coins guys so I will catch you in a bit to see how, how much sold and how much if did we make any profit see you guys okay guys so I've only been gone an hour and it looks like we've already made a profit which is quite nice to see actually and um, so yeah uh, let's just get back into it let's see who sold and obviously who hasn't so look it looks like Opa Day has sold for 800 coins oh it's quite good and Lee for 700 Bennett for 200 Les Kellers for um, 250 and Sa is it Sa? just Sa for 1500 and as you can see it's a few extra consumables here which is sold as well it's quite nice so now I'm just going to put all of these players back up for sale guys as I go to bed and I will catch you guys in the morning to see who has finally sold. See ya. Okay guys, so I have left it overnight and I have come back and I have seen that we have got 9,426 coins. So it looks like we have made a profit of around... 1,400 coins guys, which you know, over a day, it's alright, it's not a major profit, 
So if we keep doing this, we should be able to build up a decent profit. So as you can see, Parry sold for 200 coins. Uh, Jacobs for 400 coins. Al Hariri, which is actually the uh, first player to sell, sold for 250 coins and a contract for 200 coins. So what we're going to do now, I'm just going to uh, discard the rest of the players that didn't sell just to get that extra bit of money just to see what we our final total was okay let's keep quick selling this now so it should come to around about uh, 9600, 9650 I don't know so I'm sort of happy with that so we did manage to make a profit so we tested this out and it looks like it does work. It doesn't give you that much coins, obviously, but it's probably worth it if you just want an extra few coins here and there to sell the rest of these kits. Now, we did get two Northampton kits. I thought they might sell just because of Akin Fenwar, but obviously not. So, there we are, lads. Let me just click back onto my home and go back into my Chapar. They're all gone. So, here we are. So, our total profit is around about. Actually, it doesn't matter. I'll put it on the screen in a minute. So thank you very much for watching, guys, for the first episode of Bronze Pack Method Making Money on FIFA 13. Uh, look out for episode two. should be coming pretty soon. See you guys later.